Warning. This channel features sarcasm and jokes. If you are offended by anything, we do not care. I, I don't know anything about badminton players. I just... I've played this guy recently. I played this guy some games recently. Play Caro. He's very high rated. I don't know if he's deserving of this rating. Knight G1? That's crazy. I mean, I should go back. It's really, it's, it's, this is really unfair, by the way, that he can go back and I can't. Uh, wow. Okay. This is a terrible. Okay. I don't. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what I did to like offend this guy. I don't know why he's he's doing this. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know. Uh, he and I have had like normal games before. I, I don't know. Maybe he's just tilted or something. Did like a Polish football team lose recently? Like I... I'm very confused. I don't know. He disrespected me? That, correct. I, I'm, I'm playing the game. I, I know what's happening. I, I can see. Uh, you don't have to... You don't have to tell me. I can see it happening live. I did say he wasn't deserving this rating. You're right. But he doesn't know that. He doesn't know I said that. I mean, I'm just a pawn up, right? Like, he's played this in, a, in, in some odd way. I'm just making improving moves for now, and I don't know. Then we will decide what's next. Maybe I'll seal away his bishop. Oh, I also had this. That was just... And I hung the pawn? I just hung the pawn like that? Okay, at least I'll seal his bishop. That was so stupid. I mean, d3 was just completely winning. I don't know. I, I, I'm just not used to being disrespected like this, you know? It's, it's bad. I, I, I need more disrespect practice. Um, my position is still fantastic, but I was just winning on the spot. Um, I mean, he did play, like, four tempi for me. Okay. My idea is to remove... I mean, frankly, I... Like, I shouldn't have any ideas. I should just win the game. I mean, he gave me like five extra moves. Like, I, I, don't, I don't know what I'm analyzing. You know? It's kind of overkill. To like analyze anything here. I just feel like... Okay. Let's anchor the bishop. I'm trying to get a... This. Yes. Of course. Makes sense. I think he's gonna go here. The thing is, once you play people long enough... You, try, you start to like understand their little... Subtleties. I'm just gonna... Uh, you can have this. I don't, I don't need this. I just want to give a checkmate. This is the idea. I don't know if it works. He's offering me a draw. Okay. What? What is wrong with this guy? I don't... 
I mean, I'm worse. I don't... I don't... Why did I accept? No, I mean, I was completely winning, but then I hung a pawn, which... F5 was a completely brain-dead move. Uh, the only reason I played F5 is because I was like, oh, I'm gonna play F5 next. It was my next move. It's the, it's the best move, too, like, regardless of what he does. And then he went here. D3 just wins on the spot. And I just did, I just... Prepared F5, and I just played F5, and he, he took on D4, and... I'm still better, but nowhere, nowhere to near the same level. Oh... So, that was good. That was. I feel like I learned a lot that game. You know, I, I think I learned how to take myself a little bit less seriously. Uh, there's, you know, there's a lot of pressure on you psychologically when your opponent does some stupid stuff like that. Uh, you, because you, because trust me, when your opponent plays like this, you you feel like a very innate pressure. Oh, you know what I wanted to do today? I actually I wanted to win a few games playing the worst opening in chess. So, no, 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 like the actual mathematical worst opening in chess. Um, if I, if I have a chance to play it, I will play it. So against this, um... I think it's g5. I think this is the worst opening you can play with black against d4, according to Stockfish. It's basically the Grob in reverse. That's why it's called the Borg. And if pawn takes, I had queen a5 check. So I'm just clean pawn down. Got absolute. Maybe hangs the bishop. He hung this. I have this. <laughs> oh, amazing. Uh, and if this, which is a desperado, trying to get this, I'm going to take this. We will lose bishops at the same time. This is incredible. I'm up 25 seconds. My opponent must feel extremely disrespected. Okay, takes. See? Yep. Okay, so now it's just equal. Now, it's not equal, because uh, he's going to go, like, here. Oh, but that's actually a terrible move. So, neither one of us... Actually, I can still castle. What am I talking about? I can still castle. I'm going to give a check, because I think this makes some unpleasant situation here for white with this pin. Yeah. D5? Or D6? Which one is better? Knight F5 too, by the way, like... Can I just go knight f5? I guess there's like queen b5. Okay, let's just take the center. We just have to play fast. Okay. I like this. I like the, the prospect of removing that knight. And I think the queen belonged on that square. We're going to go back and analyze after. I think queen b5 was the best move there for white. I think you should have traded queens. Because now I'm going to get to castle, and I have good pressure here. If take, I'm going to take with a pawn. What? Wait, but now I can just castle. And now I can do this. I couldn't do that last move. What? Is he insane? Okay, now I'm cutting off his king, and this is my idea. He has check, but I'm just gonna run. Okay. Is he gonna try to trade queens with me? Look at this. He wants to play queen e5. He's so cute. Thinking I'm gonna let him trade queens. And then this is next. <laughs> he, th he thought I was gonna let him trade the queens. <laughs> That's... Ah! But this is better. This is a fork here. Queen c5, there's rook e3. Although queen c queen c5 was he he goes back maybe I have rook e8. I think I maybe missed the chance. I think rook e3 rook g2 was good, but I just have this. Oops. 
Okay, rook g2, take here. And my... He has this, he has king h3. Then I can go queen e6 and win the endgame. But why am I winning any endgame? I should just... Go here. I'm just two pawns up. Yeah. Uh, queen... Rook d5, rook d5. Yes. Oh, I have to be very careful. There's some back rank stuff. Ooh. In fact, I might have already. Yeah, I screwed this up. Oh. God damn it. Um. Oh, wait, 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 Yeah, I'm not worried. Yes. Now we're off to the races. Uh, which pawn do I want to keep? Maybe I don't want to keep any pawn. I just want counterplay. You can only take one. Let's come back. That was a that was a bad game. I almost won with the worst opening in chess. Actually, I think technically the worst opening you can play is the England. No, no, actually, no, not at all. I think I think this is the worst first move for Black after D four. Yeah. Crazy. But I had already equalized here. Plus two and a half. <laughs> oh, queen c4! Queen c4 is a fork! Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, I did not see that. Oh, I did not see that. And clearly neither did my opponent, by the way. Um... Uh, but there's all sorts of tricks. Here I was already not worse. Okay, I thought queen b5 here was the best move. Well, this is why he's going to be a stronger player than me. Is queen b5 a good move at least? It is, but I can go here. Okay, interesting. Anyway, I wonder if I was winning in this endgame. I don't think so. I guess it was always equal. Yeah, it's always equal. It's always equal. Because the thing is, uh, even if something like this happens... Um, he just has to not allow this. He just has to go here, and uh, it's always a draw. When each side has a pass pawn like this, it's always a draw. 